This bright red colored andhra style beetroot chutney or the beetroot pachadi is a good alternative for your regular breakfast chutneys and is perfect for idlis and dosas. Welcome to my channel Curry Bites. Let's get started. Wash, peel and chop one beetroot. You will need one cup beetroot for this recipe. You can also grate the beetroot for faster cooking. You also need one green chilli. Now heat up a pan and add in a tablespoon of oil. I have used sesame oil. Once the oil has heated up, add in a teaspoon of chana dal and a teaspoon of urad dal. Now saute till both the lentils become golden. Care not to burn them. Now add in the chopped beetroot, green chilli and a spring of curry leaves. Now on medium flame, add half a cup of water and allow this to cook for about 7 to 10 minutes or till the raw aroma goes off. If you have grated the beetroot, then it would require only 5 minutes to cook. Now I'll cover and cook till the raw aroma goes off. For every 2 or 3 minutes, till once. It's been 9 minutes and we can see that the water has completely evaporated and the beetroots are cooked. Now turn off the flame and allow the beetroots to cool down. Meanwhile in a mixer jar add in a handful of grated coconut. To this add in half a teaspoon of tamarind paste and salt as per your preference. I have used about half a teaspoon of salt. Now transfer the cooked beetroot to the mixer jar. Now add in water as per the consistency you desire. I have used about half a cup of water as I wanted the chutney to be on the thicker side. Now blend it well to a fine paste. Just look at the bright reddish pink color. Now in a tempering pan, add another tablespoon of oil. Once the oil is hot enough, turn off the flame. Add in the mustard seeds, allow it to crackle. Add in the urad dal. Once the urad dal have beautifully golden, add in a spring of curry leaves and a red, dry red chilli. Now pour the tempering over the chutney. And it is ready to be served. This goes well with idlis and dosas or even perfect for rice and rotis. Thank you for watching this video. Hope you found it useful. Subscribe to my channel for more future recipes.